You are red because of my blood. My name is Folly and uh, uh, we are here to uh, present in the, the most beautiful handicrafts of Cameroon, which is called pate. My mother-in-law uh, used to collect lots of pata work from ages ago. So this is more like a family um, artistic place. Making a pata, almost five ladies are involved. The first one has to make this fabric. After that, we ask someone to make us some patterns. This one we call it the maternal botija because it has got a little child inside of it. And some of them are the parrots, some of them are the, the canaries. And then the next step is someone who highlights the, the whole patterns by doing the embroidery. This is just a simple embroidery, so the needlework is not that special. It's just to, just to highlight what is really going to happen. The next step, it's a simple embroidery. So this is the next one. It is usually used for flowers, for the blossoms, and some of the leaves. The next challenge is patadouzi. This kind of, let's say, 3D embroidery. It takes long, long times, and it's very difficult. And since it is difficult and complicated, um, it makes pata very, very precious. Pate used to be in red. Nowadays we have just changed the color. But uh, the, those old women used to say that you pate, you are red because of my blood. Um, you just came to Kermani, you visited that this is something like the desert area. We really cannot make the gardens ourselves outside the houses. So there is no garden, there is no flower. By bringing colors inside the houses, we're making those the, the Persian paradise gardens and um, the colorful stuff that we have never had around our house inside the house.